Hi, I'm Dr. Michael Lang. I'm the founder of Lang Eye Care and Associates, the Lang Eye Institute, and Fortify Vitamins. I'm also a syndicated radio show host for the last eh, 25 years, uh, all on nutrition and eye care called Ask the Doctor. A lot of you may have heard me over the last 25 years. Anyway, today, as you can see, we're out in the sun. It's a beautiful day here in Ocala, Florida, and we're going to talk a little bit about vitamin D, vitamin D3 to be specific. All right, we've been told time and time again to stay out of the sun because the sun's bad for you. Well, I beg to differ, all right? We all need a little bit of sunshine. So about a half hour of sun a day will keep the doctor away. So about a half hour of sun between 12 and 2 is a good idea. Uh, the vitamin D3 that you get from the sun is much better than what you're getting from a supplement. You have to be careful with supplementation. Remember, vitamin D3 is a fat-soluble vitamin, and you can take too much. You can build up toxic levels. However, you can't really get a toxic level from the sunshine. So, God put the sun up in the sky for a reason to get your vitamin D3. Remember, many people are vitamin D3 deficient. As a matter of fact, uh, when I do intracellular blood analysis on my patients that have macular degeneration and dry eye, one of the biggest deficiencies they have is actually vitamin D3. And I found we can supplement with 5,000, even 10,000 units of vitamin D3, and sometimes they still have a deficiency. But if they get a half hour of sun a day without sunscreen on a daily basis, their deficiency seems to go away. Remember, this is all about anti-aging. And vitamin D3 is a potent steroid hormone that actually has some anti-aging attributes. So take advantage of what God put up in the sky. Just a half hour a day will help keep the doctor away. All right, I'm out of here. Have a great day, and God bless you.